into MMA Made Easy, where we break hard techniques and easy jumps. Uh, today we're going to be looking at a ricochet takedown from uh, the Dumont Elbow Flinch. So, I'm here and I have my partner, and I get some forward momentum going. What I'm going to do is I'm going to loop around, catch his shoulder, and I'm going to bring it into my chest and then ricochet off at a 90 degree angle. Okay, that's why it's called a ricochet takedown. So I'm here, I pull in, loop around, rip the shoulder, pull in to the 90 degree point, then ricochet off and come into the ground. Okay? Now, the great news is, is that uh, if it hasn't been done to you before, there's a real good chance to switch to a face plant, which is awesome. <laughs> okay? Uh, because as the face hits the ground, the shoulder can pop up. So, two for one. All right, so <laughs> we're here, and <laughs> I won't do it fast. Uh, okay, from here, we're just going to pull, loop around, catch, ricochet in, off and drag. Okay? Uh, I like to finish this up with a real big knee uh, to the body here. Oh, you can also switch and view the face. Not as effective though. I like to hold it here and just oh, hit this. From there, if you want to escape this way, you can simply by pushing forward and they'll be rolling uh, as you're escaping. If you don't want to lead that way, then you can just hit them and then just take off and they won't be too worried about you leaving. In fact, they'll probably prefer it at this point. 